Developing now, an investigation is underway into how two planes collided at Hartsfield Jackson International Airport, the crash causing major damage to at least one of the planes. Fortunately, we're told no one was hurt here, but take a look at this damage. You can see the tail wing of the plane attached to another aircraft. According to an airport spokesperson, the collision happened just after 10 this morning at the intersection of the two taxiways in the North Airfield. 11 Alive's Joe Ripley digging deeper into what could have caused this collision. And Joe, you're learning that there could be several factors actually behind this crash. That's right. That's all according, Jennifer, to an aviation expert I spoke with earlier today who tells me federal officials are currently looking into those factors. Meantime, as for those passengers on board both those planes, we're told by Delta Airlines tonight they've all been placed on different flights as of this afternoon. A little morning mayhem at Hartsfield Jackson Atlanta International Airport. The tail wing of an aircraft clipped off just off the runway. Hey, you have a car in a parking space and there's not quite enough room for him and somebody comes along and the back of his car sticking out in the road and they hit him. Aviation expert Alan Armstrong draws a simple comparison to what could turn into a complex investigation. In aviation, it is not one thing that kills you or one thing that causes an accident. It's normally two or three or four things that combine in a bad outcome. The collision happened just after 10 Tuesday morning at the intersection of two taxiways on the North Airfield, according to an airport spokesperson. A Delta Airbus A350 was waiting to take off for Tokyo, Japan, when its wingtip hit the tail of an Endeavour Bombardier CRJ900 bound for Lafayette, Louisiana. Delta says the 221 passengers on its flight had to be bused to the concourses. The Endeavour plane, meantime, had 56 passengers on board. They were able to get off the plane once it made it back to the concourse. No one was hurt. And if that placed his tail in the taxiway, and if the crew taxiing by in a perpendicular fashion to his tail didn't discern that, then we have an accident. Armstrong says the NTSB and FAA will look into the causes and the conduct of those involved. We've got to be in our game. I mean, pilots, they've got, they've got to be skillful and alert and operate the aircraft properly. And this marks another incident for Delta today, which had two employees unfortunately lose their lives in an explosion. A third person was injured in that same incident, which remains under investigation tonight. We're live at Hartsville Jackson. Joe Ripley, 11 Alive News. All right, Joe, thanks a lot. Let's turn.